Have you heard the tale of Zul, the destroyer of shins? Well, that's what I'm here to share with you tonight. You see, long ago, when the Earth was much more different than it was today, a terrible creature roamed the ancient lands of Montana. A creature so frightening that all other dinosaurs looked on in fear and trembling when it was near. I myself pity the poor Tyrannosaurs that meddled with Zul for what is both their first and last time. You see, what made this creature so terrifying was that it was an ankylosaur, a type of plant-eating dinosaur known for wielding near-impenetrable armor and a lethal rock-hard club at the end of their tails. Zul had these features and wore them well, with bony masses protruding all over its body, including its head and limbs. These traits are the exact reason why this animal was named Zul Crara Vastator. The first part of its name comes from the infamous demon dog that served as the gatekeeper of Gaza, featured in the first Ghostbusters movie. Just a quick side-by-side -side of their heads, and you can see the resemblance. This animal was truly a beast to be reckoned with. Its scientific name can be translated from Latin to mean Shin Destroyer, which is anything but an exaggeration. Remains have been found of several predatory dinosaurs that tried their luck and failed with creatures like Zul, resulting in their shin bones facing harsh injuries. The discovery of Zul was no joke either. It was discovered by a commercial fossil company that was digging for Tyrannosaur skeletons and was then acquired by the Royal Ontario Museum in Toronto. With scientist Victoria Arbor and David Evans quick to start studying this impressive find, they soon found an unusually flattened club and spikes running down the length of its tail. Its head, meanwhile, has noticeable peaks and pyramids over the eyes, and short horns projecting back. These features are expected, but what's unusual is that with Zul, it's the first time both were found in the same discovery. Most are missing either their front or back ends. Not only were the bone fragments discovered here either. Keratin on the armor was amazingly preserved, partially mummified to be exact. This shows us details of the animal's tightly fused armor and gnarly bumpy skin. Zul wasn't just your average dinosaur. With a legacy of breaking bones and taking names, it will go down as one of the most formidable animals to walk the earth. A tank with an appetite. <laughs> <laughs> uh.